one i want to show you how to import your autocad drawings to your revit models for those of you having difficulty on how to model on revit architecture so this is my revit workspace i've already made set my levels my natural ground level ground floor level and my roof level so i will go to my autocad drawing this is the autocad plan i want to import to revit so what i do first of all copy it out you create a different a different file for your importing to revit just create a new autocad file and make the, do the basic settings you just you don't need any other thing just do the basic setting i already created mine i'll just go and open it now and this is it this is my imported drawing now i have this is my imported drawing so I, as you can see there is no other drawing in the workspace just my floor plan so i will save that and go to my revit so in my revit i go to my natural ground level first of all we go to insert for those of you using 2016 and other versions like that has this kind of interface so i'll go to insert on your insert go to insert import card this is my drawing i'll click remember to click on click current view only if you want the view this important drawing to be on the only the view that you are which is my natural ground level but if you don't want to want to view it on all you want to view your important drawing all, on all your views so you can just leave this but i want it to just be on natural ground level for now i'll click open so as you can see some of my import has good very far just zoom out click click on the imported drawing go to up or on pin click it you can then move it to your workspace your cardinal points you can move it to your divisions so this is my imported drawing so from here now I can start drawing my walls. I have created my walls. I have six inches wall, nine inches wall. This particular wall is six inches wall. So I can start drawing. Then I create my wall height, which is three thousand four fifty millimeter. So from here <coughs> I can start tracing it out as if I'm tracing on paper. The object snap in your Revit will make it easier for you to navigate through the middle of the wall. That you can actually choose this from here. Either you want to center the wall, which is better option, or you want it these other options, exterior, interior, or center. Cent wall center line is preferable for this. So with this, you can just trace out your plan which you have made in AutoCAD so we are done with my walls I want to add my doors and my windows but when I come to my natural my ground floor level I can't find my imported joint it's just simple go, go to insert again import just pick it pick the drawing double click on it and to open click on it again on pin then you can now actually move it to your workspace click on move click on the particular node which is the same with the floor plan and pick it here well as you can notice the windows and doors are not showing why because it is at the background so you just click on the imported drawing you know that your properties tools bar you see draw layer select foreground you can see that my windows and every detail i have on the imported drawing is showing so with this now i can actually add my windows with my windows i select this i go select the kind of window i'm looking for i already have my windows 1.2 meter by 1.2 meter window so you can actually place, place them where you have it on your AutoCAD 
inverted drawing it's as simple as that so you can actually do that for the rest of your window so let's go to door actually place your door sorry about that door I have my room door So as you can see, it's making my work as fast as possible. And then I can actually put my arc here. Let me go to wall opening. Wall opening. Like this. And So, as you can see, you can see it makes my work faster. So, I can really do that for all my floor plans and it makes work easy, right? Yes. So I hope this video is helpful to you. Please like our page and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.